In 2009, President Obama declared a national emergency 11 days after the first case of swine flu was reported. Although vaccines arrived late after most infections had happened, fewer than 15,000 Americans died, even as at least 60 million Americans were infected. The Trump administration waited 53 days after the first case of COVID-19 was detected in the U.S. to declare a national emergency. During those weeks, the president himself declared the virus is going to disappear like a miracle. Our infection surveillance, the first tool of public health, was particularly poor after decades of underinvestment in public health. This set the stage for a catastrophically bad national response until we were saved by astonishingly effective vaccines. While COVID-19 was much worse than swine flu biologically, we still got lucky with COVID-19. While mortality from COVID-19 will likely end up being around 2%, mortality from SARS was 10%, MERS 34%, and H7N9 bird flu more than 39%. Why do we think that these will not become pandemics in the U.S. in the future?